For years, business people have relied on Adobe's Acrobat technology for clarity, for getting our message out clear and concise so that people can read it exactly as we plan them to see it. Now, lately, we've been also using Acrobat for collaboration, for collaborating on documents. But there's a whole new form of collaboration that's built into Adobe Acrobat 8. And Colin Smith from Adobe is joining me to talk to me about a surprising direction of collaboration in Acrobat 8. That's right. Real-time meetings are built into Adobe Acrobat 8. Real-time meetings. Yep, it's something called Adobe Acrobat Connect. Okay, how does it work? Well, it works right at the top of our toolbar. I've got a button that says Start Meeting. When I click here, it launches my independent meeting. So with Adobe Acrobat, you get a personal meeting center like we've got here, and you can invite 14 other people, and those people get invited to the meeting for free. So this is going to be a meeting that we're going to hold over the Internet, which we're going to collaborate on a document. Exactly. How do you get people into your meeting? You email them the URL, which, by the way, is the exact same URL. It's my meeting slash Colin, so I can even put it on my business card so you know exactly where my meeting is. So let's meet next week at same place, same time. Exactly. Okay, now I'm going to try and enter your meeting. So I am doing it through a web browser. And yep. Cool. It'll work in any operating system? Mac or Windows, doesn't matter. So I'm requesting an entry. So this would be like I've received an email from you. I've just clicked on a link. It's yep. launched my web browser. Yep. And now I've requested a meeting to you. I see you. You're right down there. Now people think, oh, it's fast because they're in the same, they're in the same studio. But this is real time. That's right. I am connected right now to Adobe's servers in the U.S. And I am connected to Adobe's servers in the U.S. And it's through those servers that we're connected. Yes. So this is a realistic look of how this application Real time. works. So I can either decline if I'm not show, sure who you are or I'm going to... just blocked entry. I'm going to accept you. Okay. There you go. So oh, come man, on I into the meeting. To, I was starting to feel bad. Okay. <laughs> there you are on the left-hand side. I can change you from a participant to a presenter. Oh, no, now my icons just changed. Very cool. So now if I had something to say, I can say it. Yeah, you can present your screen, I can present my screen, and we can share this stuff in real time. All those 15 people can share. Let me see your screen. I, I want to see the document you're working on, Colin. Okay, so there's a big button that says share my screen. Okay. Simply click on that. And now and it's I, coming. I can share the desktop or a window or an application. I'm just going to click share. And I'm going to jump right into my word processor and you should see I that I can document. see actually your whole computer now. And I see your cursor moving. Mm -hmm. So this is, this is staggering. <laughs> You've just highlighted the, the first paragraph. And I get rid of it. I don't like it. And you have gotten rid of it. And you know what? I don't like the bar. I don't like the pie chart. Don't like pie charts. Get rid of the pie chart. Now this is starting to look like a good time. <laughs> this is amazing. So I see up here camera option. Yeah. What happens there? Well, I can come back in here and share my camera. I happen to have a built-in USB camera in here. So there I am. Hey, how's everybody doing? <laughs> so you can add that to see who's paying attention yeah. and who's checking their BlackBerry. <laughs> you know. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay. You, you want to make sure you don't have your pajamas on for this meeting. You Unless it's a pajama meeting. Well, exactly. It's, you can have those. We've got a chat window and the note window in here. We can uh, resize this window if we want. Now, what um, about phone conferencing as a part of it? There is a built-in 15-person phone bridge up in the top right-hand corner. We can send everybody the number here. It's not toll free, but those other 14 people plus myself can join that phone bridge and we can listen to each other in real time. In real money, how much does this cost? Well, for the first 30 days, it's free. After that, it's $39 US a month or $395 a year. Now, that's what I pay. The 14 other people connect to this meeting completely for free, both Mac and Windows. They just need a browser. So just one person in your work group has to pay. Very compelling technology. The fact that it works in all operating systems is really amazing. Colin, yeah. thanks for sharing this with us. Thank you, Steve. Very cool stuff. We've got more cool stuff coming right up, so stick around for more Dotto Tech.